All right, guys, Mr. Extra here with Team Extra. We also have... Introduce yourself, boys. Hello. Hi. Uh, I'm Sterling, and I am the resident Cyber Dragon player. And I was looking to build Dragon Link, and now I'm sad. You, you don't got to tell people what you're doing <laughs> on the side. All right, who else do we got here? Who else do we got here? Hey, this is Yami Koro. Yami Koro. He, play, he plays sprites. Anyway, so, you all have already seen... Banlist got dropped literally on the fly. And by the way, boys, this is a... For anyone who's watching, this is clearly an emergency ban list. Don't assume this is the real deal. When they only ban, like, a handful of cards, when I say handful, they literally only ban or made changes to, like, five cards, right? Um, it means there's going to be something else happening after this YCS, so look out for it. So, we're going to go over what got hit and everything. First off, the first thing... And the best thing that they did here, by the way, and for anyone who uh, followed our ban list predictions, I was actually right about this one. But, I mean, everyone's seen it coming if you play in this current meta. Uh, Rise Heart finally got banned. Thoughts? I know everyone in the in this VC right now enjoys that. There's no one who doesn't, right? That's good. Now, Rise Heart was a big problem, and people had to play very weird against this card because it's like Walking Floodgate, Walking Macrocosmos. It basically makes cash. People are still going to play cash, guys. I'm going to tell you that right now because they're going to cope for a while. But it's just going to, they're just going to, they're going to play like more Ogre, like Cash Tira Ogre, and more Scareclaw probably than just maximize on their numbers rather than their big body. That's pretty much what yep. they're probably going to do, and then hope. They're going to hope and pray they draw a shifter because their big win con was literally shifter and a rise heart. Outside of that, it's just letting Fenrir pop off. The deck is going to hey, get crippled. Hey, they're now playing birth control. Yeah. That's all. Birth control, that's actually a really good way to see it, actually. But right after this <laughs> YCS, expect this deck to fully get kicked in. Fenrir is probably going to go to one, and then the deck is going to become non existent and finally drop into the grave drop into the ground next to all the other decks that should never have been an idea to begin with. So, let's um let's go down to the next thing. All right, all right. Um uh I was wrong about this, but at the same time I was hoping it wasn't like this. So, we're, we're going to go over the next one. Uh Magma got put down the one. Little little unfair expected them, but I mean, they did not touch Slabellion. So, I mean, we're fine and for someone who plays Dragon Link on Master Duel and in this current meta and in person, Magnum at one doesn't change a whole lot. It just kills the consistency a little bit. But I mean, you can you can still you can still make it work if you know what it's you're doing. It's an extra two debt slots. <laughs> What'd you say? It's an extra two debt slots. Yeah, that's basically what I ended up saying about it. I mean, I'm upset about it, but it's fine. I'll just play the one secret. You know, the good stuff. All right, uh -huh. let's go ahead and cover the next thing. Chaos Space. Chaos Space got put to one. This was not even a prediction. I don't know why they did it. I mean, I get it. They're trying to kill the consistency in dragons, but the problem with dragons is uh, it's not a problem, but there's no way you're going to 100% destroy this deck. There is too many moving pieces in this deck. There is too much stuff going on to just stop it completely. Not to mention, say, if they took out, like, Magnumut, Chaos Space, and Lebellion, there are backup engines that people would play to basically suffice for it like the adventure package for example what is your what's your all's thoughts damn it they hit dragon link and not branded wow i don't know why they didn't hit branded brandon's lived its life cycle why is i don't know why i mean i'm one of those people who usually they're, they're, they're making me hate branded more man like come on i mean i usually smack up branded i don't have an issue because the best deals alone will win best deals and ash will literally win you the match against branded especially if you are um... oh no i just like you the deck <laughs> the deck's the deck's okay I mean, I used to play it. I like the card, well, the deck, but it's lived its cycle. It needs to, um, it needs to go somewhere. Personally, not a huge factor, but there's other factors that personally I feel like they should have touched Pearly a little bit more. You know, limit something else. But it looks hey, like it looks like they're gonna try to strong arm <laughs> Pearly into the being the best deck. Delicious is already too much. No, 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 no. We ain't done. We ain't done. They should do a little bit more. Uh, White Cat to one. They should. White Cat to one yeah, because it, it is not once returned. Or Arata to being once returned. 
All right, so we'll go over the last thing on this. This is a very short video because this was clearly an emergency ban list prior to the YCS to, you know, change things. Konami's probably finally getting tired of seeing Cash Tier being all over the place or, you know, they just like to be a menace and ridicule us some more, but it's fine. They made a good choice for once. Orange Light came off the ban list. It was at two. It is now back to three. Let me tell you what Orange Light's good for right now because, I mean, that's one of those, like, where they just kind of do it for no fucking reason. Uh, literally tier and drytron specifically no orange light was played on a lot more in drytron i'm going to elaborate uh what are you saying cora i'm saying pirelli's because you're playing furries in the deck yeah orange light the three will get it's going to get played in pearly it's going to get played in drytron back at three uh manadium can play it now at three by the way boys oh, tier pirelli's great they've been, they made hold it on. Better for um tier can play it at three which it'd be kind of breaking tier. I wouldn't do that if I was playing tier, but I mean, that's another deck that should just stay in the fucking ground. You only play it for fairies. Unless you play a diviner. Tier usually plays diviner, though. But, um, Medalche can play Orange Light 3 and they can search it, too. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> they, they literally, they have like two different, I think it's two different ways to search it. When they put a vertical package. Yeah. Alright, last yeah. card. Last card to talk about real quick, because this will be a short one. Uh, Salomon Great Gazelle is at three. Oh, yeah. First off, I'm going to say uh, Kali from the Kali Effect. Oh, he's going to roll in this, dude. He's going to roll in this, because that man has been saying been saying it's going to go three forever, and he's a Salomon Great player. He's going to roll in that right there. So uh, Salomon Great is officially back to full power, guys, by the way. So there's that. So if you ain't man, if I don't see a top of freaking Vancouver. You think Salad? You think Salad's better than Unchained? Yes. Ooh, I didn't know that. I think Salad's better than Unchained because Salad can uh, Salad can potentially stop Unchained before it gets going, especially if it's going first. Exactly. I mean, they just set up Rage and um, well, what's the other one? Well, Salad has to go first. Yeah. But Salad could also do some dumb stuff and throw out the fire statue. They wouldn't do that. Not not inherently. No, but it would not be in, hard. In in the year of our Lord twenty twenty three, Salad is not running a barrier statue. They don't need to. They have. No. I mean, go go back and read what the they, new the new monsters. They, they've been making Bagoo stuff for a long freaking time. <laughs> no, no, no. Just go read what those new monsters do. But. Aside from that, uh, what is your guys' overall take on this emergency ban list? It's really bad. Yes, it's bad. That's it. It's I not great. I mean, they, they hit Dragon Link. I can see the hate, and they hit Cash Deer, which now it's just birth control. But, like, come on. Yeah, yeah, Do that's a something. That's a you know, because I'm just poking them with a stick. Come on. Do something. Let's just, just Gamma. There's oh, just Gamma to three. Gamma back to three would have been crazy. I would have loved that. But I play Gamma oh, already. <laughs> I already play Gamma, so it doesn't matter to me. But um, my uh, my little hot take on this is um, hitting the Rise Heart was worth. That should have happened like the previous ban list, but they wanted like you know, live the glory dream a little bit longer, make people buy in. They they wanted people to buy the tens. They wanted people to get the reprints and shit. Same thing with uh, hitting Magnumut, but they didn't hit Labellion, so, I mean, not all the best deals are offline. Just Magnumut is down to one, which kind of hurts, but, I mean, hey, we're, we're, we're fine. Just the ban list after the YCS, the actual ban list, from them doing this for the emergency ban list, this next ban list is going to be heavy. They're gonna cripple some yeah, stuff. Yeah, their list will be stupid heavy. Yeah, they're oh they're they're prepping up. They're prepping up to drop a bomb on us, guys. That's all I'm gonna say. Unchained might get hit me. Unchained will probably. I feel like I feel like they'll do something dumb like Yama to one. It's like, well, they all are, they they can run just one Yama and be fine anyways. Maybe, but that's uh that's about all we got over here from the team. Here's Banless reaction as you all. You guys didn't request, but I mean, come on, guys. You you already know we were gonna be on top of this. I mean, it's been less than two hours, and the video is already here. <laughs> but um, uh, like, comment, subscribe if you think that this is an emergency ban list, and that they're gonna drop a ban list after the fact. 
like the video. If you think that they hit the wrong stuff and that they hit other, they hit it wrong, leave a comment in the video. And if you haven't subscribed, what what are you doing? Like, why you're you're watching the video? You might as well click the button. You might as well.